Good morning. Welcome to Pete's Garage. Today is Saturday of the Thanksgiving weekend. Today I'll be working on the burb. This morning I set up the new diesel electronic gas pedal with the correct wiring, I hope. But in order to test it, I have to turn on the computer. And to turn on the computer, I have to fix a mistake. And so I'll be working on the steering column again. So get to it. So when I redid my column, everything went well. It's nice and solid, but I forgot to connect the rod. I don't even remember seeing it. And unfortunately, I have to disassemble it all the way back down to get to where that rod connects to the key. So, ha, guess what I'm gonna be doing today? Alright, well I'm deep into my into my column and that part right uh, there that's the ignition rod and this part here is supposed to hook onto that and when I put it all back together I forgot to make that happen and uh yeah bad things happened so i will fix that and then we will be good to go Well, progress. This is the drive-by wire throttle pedal for a GMT 400 diesel. On this throttle pedal, it was mostly a plug and play. However, there were a couple of things that I had to do. First, I had to move one of the pins. Basically, it was the ground pin from here to here. Um, the other thing that I had to do, and I don't know if this is because it's a 2005, I have seen some that say it plugs right in and I haven't seen anything that said I had to do this, but in my application, this plug did not plug directly into the connector here. The, uh, the alignment slots were reversed and there's one on this side and in the other plug, for the other throttle pedal that's on this side. So I had to cut a slot on the inside of the plug here so that it would fit with the groove so that it would key in correctly. Um, everything else lined right up and the side slots worked really well and once I got that groove cut in it plugged right in and it works fine. And it goes all the way from idle to 100% throttle in the travel of the pedal. Um, so that's good to go. Okay, uh, we are connected well to Torque Pro. Uh, that's throttle at idle. All right. You can see the throttle position goes straight to, well, 99.6, which is as much a full throttle as I think I'm going to get. And you can also hear the throttle actually working. And if I come over here and look,
it's actually working. I can see the throttle actuator um, moving the butterfly valve. So, um, yeah, that's good.